Good morning and welcome to Portland today. That's Emily Lambert, a local musician with a New Year's Eve show. In just a couple of weeks, we're going to hear more from her coming up in just a few minutes. Before we do the music, we're going to do a little shopping. We're checking out one of the best opportunities to show block, uh, sh shop show local, block. <laughs> shop local, shop <laughs> local for Christmas gifts. The Portland Night Market kicks off in just a few hours. Tracy Berry exploring some of the deals you'll find there. Hello, Mackenzie. Hello, Ashley. Hello, Drew. Happy Friday. I am Friday. Kathy today. I am you Kathy are. Marshall. Well, let's Welcome. see what Tracy is up to out there, <laughs> doing a little shopping on her Friday afternoon. Oh, you guys, I am here in the calm before the storm. It's a good storm, but it is a storm that hits this afternoon at Portland's Night Market. And I'm here with one of the co-founders, Emma Pallett, and everything looks like it's going quite smoothly. You open at four this afternoon. We do, everything's going re really well. We've got our vendors loading in in just a few minutes here. So what will people find at the Night Market? Gosh, we've got all sorts of things. Um, anything from plants to desserts, lots of great food. You you can come and have a craft cocktail or a beer uh, bring the whole family it's all ages and the events free Emma I know that like 20,000 people show up to this to do some shopping with local businesses and with local makers it's really an amazing setup here but what's the best way for folks to navigate well we have 175 different vendors here at the event this weekend so the best way to navigate it is to come early if you come early there's plenty of room to walk around to visit all the vendors and and have a great time. You also said on Sunday could be a great time for families. Sunday's perfect for families. We'll allow strollers on Sunday and the hours are from 4 to 11. So bring the kids and come and have brunch or lunch. It'll be great. Why a night market? Well, you know, we wanted to activate our district in a really unique way. People don't come to the Central East Side very often uh, at the nighttime, and so we wanted to bring people down to our district in a, in a fun way. And my family at City Liquidators, when we travel for our business, we've seen a lot of night markets, and so we thought, what a cool way to activate our district. You said you really feel like this is a way to bring the community together without a lot of cost for people. You can come here and have a great time and not spend a dime, which we don't recommend. We we want you to spend money for the for the businesses but it really isn't that you know it's a great community event absolutely you know we really want to bring our community together and just surprise and delight people so when they go out outside or upstairs in the art gallery that they can just um, stumble upon some really exciting things like music they've never heard or art they've never seen uh, makers who are creating something really cool right here in in Portland okay I'm gonna put you on the spot off the top of your head just run down a list of some of the items people might find here Gosh, they can get some beautiful art, great Christmas cards, jackets, nail polish, candles, um, all sorts of packaged food, tons of great stuff. As well as having dinner and having a local craft brew. Absolutely. Yeah, we have um, 15 different hot food vendors, so you can get food from all over the world here tonight. And how's the best way for people to get here? Gosh, we'd love if they could ride share or um, if they want to take the streetcar. It's just one block away. Oh, that's nice. There's a little bit of noise, but people, we are setting up here because it opens today at 4 o'clock. And when we come back, Emma and I are going to show you a few of the things that you can shop for. A lot of great stocking stuffers. And Tracy, Drew still needs some ideas to get his wife for Christmas. So that I think was he just pointed attention. out on the couch, yes. <laughs> Ashley said, what are you getting me for Christmas? I said, I yes. don't know. Well.